the card following course that you see we are in the Brevran in Ethiopia and they are nailing rubber in it on its hooves so that uh, it can travel a long distance without hurting its hoof this is the way they do it however whether this is really good for the animal or not I asked them and they say that the horses do not feel it and what do you feel as a viewer what is your opinion uh, to say something about this appalling or deplorable condition of cart pulling horses in the Bravrahan uh, the rubber is nailed on their feet as you can see and they are need their hooves you can see the the rubber as you can see here I think you can see the rubber here yes you can see the rubber here yeah. and they move over gravel road or over the asphalted road and they say it takes them five days to uh, change the rubber for these horses this is what the fodder is this this is what they eat this is how they eat also they are not well fed they are malnourished and also they whip them i will show you when they whip them afterwards if possible and they carry more than their capacity the earlier one you saw was people carrying but this is carrying goods it carries a, a just a large amount of uh, goods from a place to another so I think this one is in a good physical condition however the others are just uh, uh, in a bad one because the situation of work hurts their backs and the tails and they are not washed they don't get adequate rest there is no shower they don't wash them and they are left for hunger as I see it so my recommendation is there should be another better way of transportation using the motor than this one which hurts the animals they say that Italians introduced the system into Ethiopia it was introduced by the Italian colonizers in the 1930s and just after this that time until now they just uh, do this uh, and in towns like the Abraham the cart is a means of transport and they are just uh, using using it on such gravel roads but on the main roads it is forbidden now uh, about this nailing the hooves uh, people told me that in other parts of Ethiopia also this is common and I think a better means should come that does not hurt the animals and a number of them are here you can see a number of them here and they are now waiting for people to be transported to other quarters of the town the suburbs of the Rohan and they write graffiti behind the cart also and they say this is the king of the desert this one over here and they when they eat also they eat like this they cover their faces I think you can see Mm, there are there are cars on this road. There are cars as well, but the main means of transport is cars. Over there, I think I should show you the that symbol or what you call it. I don't know because I don't have a driver's license and I have not taken any lesson in that regard. It is. Uh, it it says I think. Parking cars is forbidden. Parking cars is forbidden here. I think you can see that.
and they have plate numbers also I think that's also uh, something important uh, look how they load and just this is how they how they move and they are loaded even sometimes they are loaded with building materials uh, they play cards the the drivers play cards on the on the cards because there is no work now I think that's the main situation and what do you feel about this what do you feel about this what should be done who should contribute what subscribe comment like and this is Mazamir and asking me what other types of uh, recording I should do look at how this man find the seat hard to go down the cart I find it's very hard so thank you for watching